there is a lot of opportunities uh, in order to, to push the sustainability of the European uh, industry. Uh, you know that the Green Deal is, of course, the best framework in the world uh, in order to promote new technology, clean tech, we can say, and to have a very a push of investment with a lot of public money, private money, in order to promote the decarbonization and also the strategic autonomy uh, in energy for, for Europe. The business need to invest a lot in Europe. Uh, the nations, the member states, uh, all the stakeholders must choose European technologies uh, in order to help your industry to grow. European Green Deal forms the basis of the competitiveness and sustainability in Europe. And uh, we need to focus on uh, clear implementation. Now the goals have been set and now we have to deal with uh, a clear implementation and clear progress in this way. There are uh, many steps that the uh, countries and the governments need to take and also the businesses need to take in order to enable sustainable uh, development. From the government side, of course, uh, there needs to be a clear regulatory fr framework in place. Uh, we have launched in Estonia also the process of climate law uh, and this has been asked from uh, different businesses uh, and it, it sets the basis which is, uh, which is needed. Of course, taxes, uh, in, uh, uh, removing uh, subsidies uh, based on, which are based on fossil fuels, uh, etc. Uh, but what the businesses are asking more is that, first of all, uh, for industry businesses, it, it's important to understand and know what is their uh, environmental and CO2 footprint. For that one, you need to have access to data. The steps that we are taking as Signify to improve our competitive sustainability are really focused on green and digital. So for one part, we are leading the lighting sector and also our company to move from all technologies, how you'd say tubes and bulbs, as we knew them from the past, to really smart and digital LEDs. And that has actually led also to a reduction of electricity consumption by lighting by, from 19%, where it was for a long time, until 2006, uh, to 12% last year. And it will go further down to 8% in 2030. And secondly, also talking uh, more about green and digital, but also focusing a lot on innovation but beyond illumination. The second recommendation is to create enabling policies. So for parts, really implement the Energy Efficiency Directive, uh, actually, so develop and deploy an adequate energy performance of building directive and combine that with green procure the circular procurement.